Final Cut Pro is finally available on iPad. And as a content creator who always edits on her phone and on the go, this is a very exciting release. Today I'm going to share with you guys a few of my favorite features and what makes editing on an iPad so unique. I'm also going to share with you how I edit for TikTok and Instagram Reels straight from my iPad. If you're like me and edit majority of your content on your iPhone using CapCut or TikTok with your finger and find that super easy, I feel like this is going to be the next great thing for us, especially because it's on a larger display and we can make very precise edits. I really like the new jog wheel where you can quickly and precisely scrub through your footage. You can also shoot high quality videos straight from your iPad and adjust the white balance, exposure and focus right in the app. With multicam, clips can automatically be synchronized and edited together. And you'll be able to switch angles on the multicam with just the touch of a finger. I am going to have so much fun with the live drawing feature. You'll be able to create unique handwritten titles and animations throughout your video. This definitely brings a little bit of spice and extra fun touch to your video content. I'm excited to see what handwritten illustrations you guys come up with. You can choose from a very broad library of professional effects, graphics, and audio. A feature I'm really excited about is the scene removal mask. You'll be able to isolate a subject and remove it from its background with a touch of a finger. This is another reason why Final Cut Pro for iPad is so quick and easy because you don't need a green screen anymore. You can just easily lift the subject straight from the background. I shoot and edit so many ASMR videos and I feel like using an iPad to edit is going to be so much better and easier and quicker because I'm making so many little cuts and it's just going to be very precise with my Apple Pencil. Final Cut Pro for iPad is perfect for editing your Instagram Reels, TikToks, YouTube Shorts and YouTube long form videos all in one spot. Let me show you guys how I can quickly edit a TikTok, Instagram Reel, or YouTube short using my iPad. First things first, I'm gonna import some photos and videos from my trip to Disney. Now I'm gonna use my finger or Apple Pencil to precisely select which part of the videos I wanna have. I'm just gonna quickly mute these clips and adjust the positioning of the photos. This is already so quick and easy. I love being able to use my finger to quickly adjust the photo. Now I'm going to go in with the live drawing tool. I'm going to select a color from my pink shirt and get to drawing. I feel like this adds such a fun touch to your videos and really makes it unique. It's also super quick and easy to do and just makes it look so much more fun. I'm going to quickly add in a title and adjust the font and stroke. I love how easy it is to navigate. This is my first time editing on it and it feels like I already know where everything is. Now I'm just adding in a song in the background and my voiceover as well. We quickly hit export and we're done. This is so quick and easy. I feel like I'm gonna pump out so much more content now that I can edit using my iPad and on the go. The subscription price is $6.99 for one month or $69 for the entire year. I know you guys are going to ask me this in the comments. iPad users can export their Final Cut Pro project to Mac, but you can't take a project from Mac and put it onto your iPad. I'm glad I could share my favorite features with you guys and show you how I edit on Final Cut Pro for iPad as well. There will be so many more videos on my TikTok, Instagram, and YouTube, so make sure you're following and subscribed here as well. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. See you next time.